Europe and, well, human societies at large on the planet are sitting right now on two time bombs. The first one is the fact that our social fabric is being steadily but surely destroyed. Inequalities are on the rise. One out of four Europeans is at or below the, the level of poverty. I mean, if you keep pulling on the social fabric, inevitably, at some point in time, human violence will erupt. And do never forget that Europe knew violence and know what it costs to society. The second time bomb is the environmental time bomb. We are right now consuming more resources that this planet can afford to give. And when we go over the limits of this planet, then you will have natural violence or human violence because we will fight for resources or a combination of the two. But those two time bombs really have the possibility of basically wiping out humanity of the face of this planet. And we are witnessing that in Europe as well. We are no longer so comfortable. And that means that we really need a change of course in the policies that we are making. Every single initiative that we are taking should be geared towards defusing these two time bombs. And thinking that growth will be the answer to that is a gross mistake. And that's basically the dominant orthodoxy that we are witnessing in Brussels and in the European capitals. Give us growth, that will generate jobs, and by trickle-down effect, everyone will be fine. That's, of course, not true. Growth increases our uh, ecological footprint, and now we have evidence that growth does not create jobs, that growth does not reduce inequalities. So let's drive towards reducing inequalities and reduce our, our ecological footprint and make sure that all European and national policies are geared towards that. Otherwise, we are headed for serious, serious trouble.